someone in the hallway is on the phone and very angry. Hey girls, it's Thursday. I'm a little bit happier than that girl outside, but I'm not in a very great mood because I have to be working on this short story for my intimidating writing majors writing class. And I'm really nervous because I've never felt this pressure before. Like I have to prove myself and I'm the only freshman in the class. So uh, hmm. if any of you have any brilliant life-changing ideas for short stories, um, comments? I can dream. <laughs> so this week's theme is nudity. No, this week's theme is Shakespeare. Coming from a self-proclaimed literary person, my adoration for Shakespeare should not come as much of a surprise to you, so I'm going to spare you the uh, rubbing his picture on my face and licking it. Because <laughs> that's what you do when you like someone, if you're me. Anyway, I'm just going to tell you reasons why I love William Shakespeare. Hmm. Number one, Hamlet. <sighs> if you've read Hamlet, you understand, and if you haven't, you probably don't want to listen to me talk about it. So instead, I'm just going to provide you with a link to a very, very hilarious video that me and my friends like to quote a lot that sort of makes fun of Ophelia, and you will like it. Reason I love William Shakespeare number two. I didn't plan this out ahead of time. Uh, let's just make it two reasons that we'll cap the list off at two. And number two is A Midsummer Night's Dream. One time was so amazing. I was with my mom, and we were seeing it outside in sort of park. And it started off in the evening when it was still light out. And by the time that, by the time it was finished, it was getting dark, and there was very little lighting. But it was all kind of like smoky and dreamlike and there was a pond behind us with little chirping frogs and it was absolutely beautiful. Today is awesome because, oh, today is awesome because I am going on a little trip this weekend and I'm going to see my boyfriend, Mike Lombardo, who is hot. And that's more or less all I can muster for a video today. So, Leanne, I will see you tomorrow. P.S. Will Grayson, Will Grayson, the new book by John Green and David Levithan, is available to buy, and I got to read it early because I'm sweet, and it's really good, and you should read it. Later. <laughs>